Hey everybody, welcome back to Cyberpunk. Uh, we are picking up somebody named Ozob or Bozo backwards, some type of clown. I need to honk when we get here and we've arrived. I have honked. Is it this guy? This guy? This guy? What the? <laughs> oh my God. Yes. Oh, fuck. What the you hell? That's the right question. <laughs> Uh, you have a grenade on your face. Uh, there's, uh, something on your face. <laughs> the grenade. Can I ask why? You have a juggling accident or So something? casual. Not cool. You ask personal questions and yet you haven't even introduced yourself. You are V, correct? Obviously, I came here and honked in the exact spot yeah, you wanted. Yeah, me. Good, then let's go. Where'd Sue? Little China, I have a craving for Kung Pao chicken. Extra spicy. Well, I don't have a feeling that doesn't mean food. This is so random. He contacted us randomly. He says he wants to work with the best. He's willing to pay whatever we want. Doesn't it bother you? What? The grenade, you know, the one on your face. I just gotta be careful not to pull the pin when I want to pick my nose. <laughs> wow. I'd be worried about somebody else pulling the pin. To mess with me. Among a whole slew of other things that are probably an issue. Like I wouldn't want to be near a microwave. Nice out here. A lot of stuff has changed. Where are you from? Brazil. You know. Oh yeah. Down in South, I know where Brazil is. <laughs> Never know with you gringos. <laughs> you wanted the best driver, and I got you here with almost not a scratch. Tiger claws. Heard of them? <laughs> yes. yes. Got any friends in there? No, why? Just asking. <laughs> this is the place. Wait for me here and keep the engine running. Okay. Way to get takeout. You could say that. No, he's gonna he's gonna slaughter them. I think. I can't switch my camera, and I really want to. Oza bozo. Yep. Watch that be his grenade. Wait, where's he going? He's hiding. What the fuck was that? You got grenades up here? Oh my god, dude. We still have this gun from the contest. Your ass too? Got it. Oh, dude. You could have just told me and I would have totally been down for this. Ha, not bad, right? It would have been even better if you told me what you were planning yeah. from the get-go. It's true what they say. You're good. Really fucking good. <laughs> Got a stick up your ass, though. This is All where right. we part ways. Good luck, V. And uh, relax a bit. Okay. So, now, you I got questions. Oh, that. My brother ripped it off during a fight. With pliers. Ooh, what a happy family. You don't know the half of it. I could have chipped another one, but... I don't know. I think this matches my style more. Uh-huh. Definitely is the style, yeah. It's a real icebreaker with the ladies. Got me powder for my nose. <laughs> and, does it work? Not really. What about my payment? What about it? Here, like I said before, the best don't come cheap. To be Take honest, I've received me. more money in the past. Hey, saying. Keep your nose to the ground. 
That is what the frick was this? Okay. New item came in blank. Let's see what this is. Sort by new here. Nothing really. We did get new aviators though. No, we'll stick with these. Thank you. Okay. How quickly could I get... I kind of want to visit Victor. And he's in this area. He's actually... Is, is this... Yeah, okay. I thought so. Wait, is this Victor? This... Yeah, this is the other way into Victor. Okay. So, I want to buy the armor implant from him now. Now that we've got cash thinking about money. swapping some chrome. You got any new toys? Have a look. Uh, down here. Immunity to shock. Oh, wait. I mean, that would also be good, I guess. Oh, this is just replacing this? Ugh. Oh, no, good. Okay, so they can both go in. I thought he had something that replaced, uh, or that gave us a 200 armor or something. Did he not? Was he not the one? Kuroshi Mark Three. I mean, I might as well. Um, operating system. He's got the Sandestivan. Or Sandavistan. Which is not really good for our build. I'd say. Carrying capacity. We're good. Hands. Oh, look, they changed the tattoo. Johnny and V. That's cool. That's really cool. Okay, so we'll leave all of this. Arms wise, mantis blades. Huh. For some reason, I swear he had like a plus 200 armor in here. Literally 200, and it was quite expensive. But I guess I was wrong. All right. Thanks, V. We'll have to throw in our mods here. So we've got the precise explosion thing. Target analysis non-lethal. We don't want any of those. I wish we had more of those modifications. All right. Ozo, have a good time, buddy. It was a it was a pleasure, an absolute pleasure working with you. Okay, so maybe what we do is head over to River and wrap that up. Where is it? It's quite far. So we'll jump over there. Out at the trailer park. And then I looked into that chipping in. Apparently, um, what we can try to do to get it to trigger is setting it as our primary quest and then waiting. Like, f using the wait in-game. And I'll try that, because that seems like the most interesting one we got going on. Ah, right. Where was I? Ah, now we go. Huh. I think it was here. It's back here. Right. I'll wait. River. Oh, Johnny. What do you have to say about this? Oh, hey. Not coming. Hi. Not really hey, my jam, picnics. But you hey. have fun. How's it going? Spinning a new song anyway. Over here. Rather focus on that. You're still writing? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> oh yeah, that's that's gonna be a number one hit for sure. For sure. Glad you're here. I need your help cooking. What's on the menu? Jambalaya. Come on. You can stir the meat. Um, soy meat. Okay. You know they have things on Amazon that can auto stir your meat now. No. River. Maybe Joss would be more help. Joss did her bit. Just grab the damn spoon and start stirring. This an ancient ward family secret? Uh huh. Onions, paprika, thyme. I just need to mince some celery and garlic. But you stir, please. Stir. <laughs> I'm stirring. I'm stirring. Bet my socks you've never had better jambalaya. You're probably right. How's uh Randy holding up? He's looking for his old self. Physically, though, it'll be a long road before he's back to full health. And, uh, mentally? That was some experience. What Harris did to him, fucked as this might sound, might have helped the kid. Could be wrong, but feels like a clean break for him. Honestly, I thought you were kidding about the cook-off. Where the Joss had sweat away in the kitchen while... How? Joss doesn't know the first thing about cooking. Actually, I like to torture foodstuffs. <laughs> Haven't had many opportunities lately. Don't mean to spoil a nice day. Huh. I wonder if you decided to do anything. I gotta ask. What about Peter Pan? You're asking if I killed him. Yes, River, we'll I later, am. Okay. Okay, sure. Sure. No pressure. It's just I, uh... You know. I know. Uh, what do you think? I kind of think he might not have done it. All right. Think you've stirred enough? Mind grabbing the rice from the kitchen? Yes, sir. I really hope that this doesn't take a turn. Like, I just hope this family has some... Some level of peace. No, Randy's always been that way. But I'm sure this didn't help none. You know, his father was a difficult man, too. That's exactly what I told him. But he always got the same speech back. Nobody cares about these kids who don't exactly fit the mold. In those words, yeah. Wanted to tear my hair out every time I heard him. Sorry, Joss. And when can I visit again? Um, where will I find the rice? Man, I'll call you back nice. later. Sorry, I got really it. Nice of you to come. Uh, thanks for having me over. I should be thanking you. Looking good, Joss. Really think so? She looks a lot thanks. healthier. How's Randy? Still in the hospital. Still in shock. But he's making progress. Haven't had a chance to tell you just how grateful I am. It was all River. I just helped. I just don't know how to repay you. If Randy uh, had... Don't owe you don't... me a thing. Yeah, guys. exactly. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm so quick to break down. Anyway, Bit strong, healthy, yeah. The rice is right there. Yeah, thanks. I uh, I got it already. Am I sensing tension? Wait, I wonder if we can. Uh... Where'd she go? Review, bloody bout seven. What went wrong? Where'd she go? Oh, she's out here chilling. Joining little Siggy. All right, well, I'll leave you be. Tomatoes in next. Now you can toss in the rice. 
Rice is in. Okay, now this has to bubble and brew. Patio. That means beers? Yes. Grab a chair and a beer or something else. Beautiful. It's nice out here. Yeah. Seems all good. Like nothing bad ever happened. Tell me now about Harris. I paid him a visit at the hospital. Okay. He's still in a coma? Yep. In a okay. strange slumber between life and death. He didn't do it. An empty shell in a hospital bed. One shot to the head. Quick and clean. I had the same thought. It would be so easy. I pressed the gun to his head and remembered something. River? How my parents died. Now, you sure you want to hear this? Uh, yes, absolutely. What happened? Old man had a farm, like Harris's dad. But when business took a turn, well... My parents managed to open a small grocery. We lived on the floor above. A loud noise woke us one night. They wanted cash. Register was empty, so they stormed upstairs, forced us all to kneel, and demanded my dad tell him where he hid the money. I'm gonna let him keep talking. Mostly, I remember my mom crying. My dad swore they'd found all we had. One was gassed out of his mind. He fired first. Blew half Holy my dad's skull. shit. Jesus, River. I'm sorry. He was erratic. One rabbit handed me his gun and ordered me to aim it at my mom's head. I can still see her tear-filled eyes at the end of that barrel to this day. No way. What did you do? Nothing. I stood frozen. Finally, he just snatched the gun back. <sighs> shot my mother and they left. Police never caught him. That was why I joined the force. I couldn't agree with scum like that Roman free. Yeah, that no changes you. Him. Holy smokes. Was just there too? Saw all this? Mm -hmm. I think when she looks at me, she still sees that boy holding a gun. Oh to my side. god, that's tough. Can't tell you how sorry I am. So when I stood over Harris in that hospital bed, barrel to his brow, I was that kid again. But I was also the junkie who shot my parents. Didn't kill him then. I've ended a few lives in my time, but never like that. Never an execution. Slipped out of the hospital quick. Told myself the case was closed. That's good, good. for you. But what now? You're not going back to the PD. PI has a nice ring to it. Huh. Who knows? Uncle River, we'll you said you'd play with us. You promised. All right, all right. Let's go. V, join us? What are we going to play, Uncle River? You'll see. That's so oh, heavy, God, man. We're playing. Yeah, big trouble in Haywood. AR Grab Game yourself. Gear. Cool. I thought I thought it was gonna be like soccer or like basketball. Oh whoa, this is like <laughs> pretty immersive. Well, what do you think? Always wanted to try a game like this. Well, well, nice firepower there. This is no time to get distracted. We can't <laughs> let that awesome. Get away. Who? Oh, well, look at you. V, 
allow me to introduce Captain Joan McLean and Lieutenant Henry Callahan. Hey, nice to meet you guys. Thank you. best and brightest. Wouldn't want to get in their way. I always work alone. No exceptions. Of course, Even Henry. Yeah, me too. Hmm. Got a crash course? Anything I ought to know? The entire city is sick with crime and corruption. Lawlessness rules the streets. And we're no saints either. Even the police are haunted by the sins of their past. But the city's without hope. No one else would ever dare face El Chamuco and Diablo. Oh, yeah, sounds oh, spooky. He's the worst. But I know we can beat him. The city's most evil mastermind ever. All right, let's get to it. Right. All we gotta do is track down El Chamuco and Diablado and take out his lackeys along the way. He'll pay for his crimes. We'll play like two teams, us and the kids, but we work toward the same objective. Cool. The team with the best result wins. Alrighty. You don't stand a chance. Hey, v, just go easy, okay? It's their favorite game. Yeah, let's just let the sure. kids win, right? Yeah, let the kids win optional. Okay, cool. Oh, there he is. Get him. The city's mine. You'll never take her from me. Get him, kids. <laughs> She's fast, but not fast enough to escape justice. Watch out. It's cronies. Not half bad. We'll take one so they don't think we're, like, totally sloughing it. Next round. Next round. This way. It must be their rat-infested hideouts. I could smell the moral decay from a mile off. <laughs> They're so into it. That's awesome. It's a trap. They were waiting for us. Hey, take that. Good job. Keep going. Save our butts. I'll help you. You guys want to shoot that one? Okay, that's all of them. But next time we gotta be faster. Oh shit, not good. Out of the way, oh, eight players ready. Obstructing justice is punishable by law. This is your last warning. Easy there, Captain. I'm just passing through. Not done yet. I can't afford to lose one of my best men. Don't worry about it. Oh my god, they're good. This is cool. The music is so fitting. It's like a Stranger Things vibe almost. Come on, River. Take the middle one. Not half bad. Okay, I think we're going to find him, guys. Whoops. Some last words. Fine. Get him! Out with it, scumbag! I wanna see you squirm. No! Your last words! <laughs> oh, come on! Another ambush? Okay, so now lunch is ready. <laughs> but mom, you almost had That's perfect. Him. Oh, you'll get him next time. <laughs> That's perfect. At least we meet the We're the best. Good job, kids. Thanks for letting them win. They had fun. 
Ah, <laughs> they're great kids. It's no problem. Seems they took a liking to you, too. Hey, food's on the table. This so, is such like a wholesome moment. Fun? I'm just waiting for it to go awesome! bad, and I really hope it doesn't. We their big butts. The bad oh, this guys. looks legit. Huh? Oh, yeah, the bad guys, too. <laughs> They're talking about beating us. <laughs> uh, they did it. They did it. Time to see if this tastes as good as it smells. Unemployment's being good to you. You seem good. River's discovering the joys of family life. That and police duty. Never a good mix. Yeah, I could imagine. This here's a way to get some of those years back. I haven't seen him this untroubled in a while. What about you, V? You got a family? Or just relations? Huh. Used to be a nomad, but the family fell apart. Years ago, feels like. Nothing's more important to me than my kids. I've made mistakes. Life's gone off the rails sometimes. But I had my kids. I got my kids. Yeah, for a lot of people, that would ground you right back to reality when things are going bad. Speaking of, it'd be great if Randy was here. Won't be long. Okay. Randy loves jambalaya. Joss, you see me being a parent ever? I mean, I don't exactly look like good palm material myself, so... <laughs> yes! Who says yes? I do. <laughs> he raised his hand himself! <laughs> <laughs> v, are you seeing someone? Involved? No. Oh. Pass up, please. Well... Um... Well, that's decided. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Got an 1199. Kinda. Officer needs backup. Come on, pull you out of this ambush. Nice save. I don't know if she's asking because she's interested. Thanks, Joss. Yeah, thanks. Whew. Situation was getting dicey. That's what partners are for. You were about a hair's breadth away from having to look at photo albums. <laughs> yeah. You just getting out I'm of doing the dishes. Me. Admit it. Also true. Which gives us two reasons to go. Where are we going exactly? Here we are. What are we looking at? A water tower. Oh, check this out. Great spot. Bet we're going up. Great for what? Having a drink? Shooting the shit. Hell yeah. This way. I... Oh, fuck. Gate stuck again. Gotta fix it one of these days. Let me give you a boost. Climb over. Open it from the other side. I don't need a boost. No need. <laughs> Whoa! So cool. Okay, we like leaping. Just push. Uh, seems easier to open from that. Ugh. Okay. That's funny. On our way. Area's not bad, actually. Unlikely to dazzle. Make a good first impression, though. Certainly no Corpo Plaza. No. But life's livable here. Know what worse places to raise kids. Randy's problems with the law. Those didn't pop out of thin air. True. But Randy takes after his old man. He'd find trouble in a nicer neighborhood, too. Is this cool up here? Apparently the worst city between the Atlantic and the Pacific. So cool. But I sure do love this view. Find it calming. Yeah, I like where we are now. Right here. Outside looking in. Away from all the urban chaos. It reminds me a bit of home. Got something for you. What's that? Wow. What's the occasion? Aiming to close the door. 
A stage of my life is done. Wow. This thing holds too many memories. Won't let me do that. It'll serve you better. Thank you. Just promise you won't <laughs> blow your foot off. Oddly specific request. Josh's husband did it. Drunk. This very spot. Oh, okay. Which makes sense this then. This your special spot. Family landmark? Something of the kind. Now for the highlight of the evening. Oh. For a drink? Something strong's sure to hit the spot. Now that I understand. There's always like non alcohol options. Oh. Oh, we no, we don't have that kind of vibe. Here's to Joss and the kids. I wasn't yeah. getting that vibe from him, not a single bit. Got any more of that? <laughs> Two bottles of whiskey and a case of beer ought to be enough. We're gonna pass we'll out up here. That. Buckle your liver in. Gonna be a long night and a longer morning. <laughs> Poof. Oh, now where did I put that? Oh, we slept in Randy's room? Feels weird. Little Adventure. Okay, Lizzie. Little Adventure was actually very inspirational. Put up my first BD today. Thanks. Couldn't have done it without you. B -E, your first BD? <laughs> what? Oh, no. It'll be all over the airwaves. Keep an eye out. I hope she didn't do what I think she might have done. Oh, colonizing the moon, and there's still no cure for hangovers. Well... At least we had fun yesterday. You would think by this point yeah. they'd figure it out. Um, but now I gotta roll. Promised Joss I'd take her to see Randy. No rush either. Get your sea legs back. Take as much time as you need. Sure you're good to drive? <sighs> Please. Former NCPD. <clears throat> I'm a pro on Hangover Highway. That really instills confidence. Be fine. Apologize to Joss for me. We kind of dined and dashed yesterday. And left puke all over the bathroom? We oh, did? shit. Ew. Tell Randy, hey. Will do. See you later, V. Crime block. What's this? What the hell? McCrane scanned the room with a deft Kiroshi sweep. This corpse was no different than the dozens he's seen over the years. The dead man's eyes froze in fear, his ligaments, wires, and intestines strewn about the floor. None of it made any impact on McCrane anymore. I've lived too long, he thought, and cops who don't die quick usually find themselves praying, playing for the other side eventually. This case is as clear as a used napkin at Deputy Zhao's, he murmured to Junior Inspector Malinowski. Guess the voice wasn't supposed to change, but it did. Cyber Psycho came in through the window. Victim let him inside, must have known each other, prints are all over the glass. Holy shit, Malinowski shook his head in disbelief. How'd the fucker get all the way up to the 11th floor? See these grooves in the windowsill? Climbing spikes, implants. Kids these days are getting installed to pull stupid rooftop stunts, get cheap thrills. Malinowski made his way over to the window to examine the evidence his superior had so effortlessly, effortlessly pieced together. The veteran detective lit a cigarette and stared back into the corpse's lifeless eyes. Although McCrane had never seen this man before, he felt as if he had known him a long time. And still, he felt nothing for him. No pity, no compassion. This is only a bloody... This is only a body now. No longer a person. Suddenly, Malinowski's unsteady voice woke McCrane from his thoughts. Uh, boss, these prints on the outside of the window, they belong to you. McCrane let out a quick, punctuating chuckle. Never took you for much of a jokester, Malinowski. The detective said with an amused smirk as he rolled up his sleeve to expose his wrist. And I wonder, how would I get up there without any climber's claws, huh? 
But before the junior inspector could respond, McCrane felt an uneasiness shoot up his spine. This room and the man, the smell of his blood, he felt compelled to walk over to the savage victim and reach inside his pocket. A photo of his own face staring back at him. Malinowski solely drew his pistol. I believed in you, the shaken protege uttered with a pain in his voice. All this time I idolized a murderer. I, I don't understand, uttered McCrane. Something else began to drown out his own words, even his thoughts, a strange primal force for the first time in my life. I don't understand. And then crack a gunshot. Pretty sure we've read that before. <laughs> but, uh... Always, always good to reread a classic. Hey. Why are we... Why the scanning? I think she's pissed. Should we see if she has anything to say in here? Good morning. Not intruding, I hope. The generator. You remember, right? Oh, fuck. Need me to fix it now? Yeah, now. Then we go to the hospital. I'd rather have everything ready for when Randy gets back. You guys sure there's nothing I can do here? Like... What's up with the generator? I don't know, but electricity's out. And then his room needs tidying. I'm supposed to do that. <laughs> I know it sounds, but this one time, please. I'll let them get to it. Okay. So, a uh, couple of things. Let's actually see if we do this. Let's Hello. see if we can force Rogue to call us here. Let's skip time. Let's just do 24 hours. Hmm. 8.17 a.m. We have a message from Claire. Heart to heart. You still sure you want to off Samson? Oh, just want to say thanks for that last chat. Don't worry about it. I've got your back. Make sure he's chewing dirt. You still sure you want to off him? Yeah, my mind's made up. You nervous about the race? Thanks for opening yourself up to me. I appreciate it. All right. I guess we're in it for... Means a lot. See you around. It'll be all right. Okay. We also have a level here. Let's go technical ability. And then let's keep working on our quick hacking skills here. Use the cost of quick hack used against an enemy already affected by quick hack. Yeah, I could see that. We actually try to stack pretty regularly. Twelve eighteen. Ah, shit! Oh boy. Where are we at? Thirty and forty percent. There seems okay. Faces a difficult choice of whether to honor the agreement, causing severe shortages in Alaska, or break the contract and forego. Yeah, I'm not sure how to get her to call us here. Very strange. So I guess if that's the case, we can we can go meet with uh, Judy. Man, we are like we're almost done all of these things that we want to do. That is so cool. I'm going to head way up here. We'll talk to Judy. I'll also try um, after this. I'll wrap it up here for today, I guess. And what I'll try to do is trigger that quest and see if I can make it happen. And if I can't, then I'll continue to do some more digging and we'll hopefully be able to figure it out. But thank you guys so much for watching, okay? I appreciate it. We'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.